So CNN has been struggling in the ratings for a while now, and they decided that they were going to make some changes to really improve the network and to start to focus on substance, which is something that they've been lacking for a while. So we now have some signs of the changes kicking in. Let's take a look. Fun. Thank if you, you think Arizona is the only place with llama drama, I want you to meet my friend Pierre. He is a celebrity llama, and he joins me now along with llama handler Susan Garal. I don't want to make any false moves here. Oh, that's okay. But this it's fine. it was this llama's famous. Pierre is famous. He is. Why? He's been on Saturday Night Live, and he actually walked the Greenwich Village Parade. He's done quite a few things. Are they known to escape like today and, and oh, run Oh yeah, around? they like to run. They like to run. Pierre likes to run if he can. And uh, you always have to have a catch pen. <laughs> and that would be an open gate lead-in. So I set him up. I have a gate open and he has to go through and that's his catch. What did they do wrong today? How did the llama... llama, llama how, did the llama <laughs> how did the llama escape? Did they do something wrong, you think? Oh, they might have just left the gate open or a fence went down. Mm -hmm. I don't know how they're escaped. Yeah. Um, how fast can they go? They're fast. Up to 35 miles an hour? Maybe. Maybe <laughs> faster. What, they're the, fast. Uh, at first, they, they, were, they thought maybe it was an alpaca, right? Uh -huh. But it's not. What's the difference? Alpacas are smaller. They're smaller. Their fiber is finer. Are they mean animals? No. No. They're not mean. But we're all... They're very docile. Oh, Pierre. Pierre's pretty cute, right? And they're actually natural guard animals for sheep. Yeah. This is what it's come to. The new media takeover of old media may happen even sooner than we anticipated. Because they keep doing stuff like this, they're not going to be able to survive. Remember the quiz show? We covered the story about the new quiz show they did. I can't believe that cleared a boardroom of people. They thought, okay, guys, what are we going to do to get more eyeballs? I have an idea. Why don't we have Don Lemon, Anderson Cooper, and other irrelevant CNN hosts do a jokey, funny quiz show on President's Day? Yeah! Who in their right mind was out to dinner with their friends, having a beer, eating a burger? They're like, guys, sorry. I'd love to keep hanging out and watch the game. I got to go home and watch this CNN quiz show. It looks awesome. I'll be back. Doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. It's like, it's almost as if they're trying to lose viewers. Seriously. Why would you bring a llama onto live TV? I know, you, oh, you think it's a cute idea. It's cute, it's funny, it's, uh, we have a llama here. How is that going to make your ratings go up and continue to stay up? How does that add to the substance of the conversation? How is that intelligent? You've become a fucking circus sideshow. He said, look at me, we got a llama. You look at a llama, it's a llama. <laughs> don't you guys want to watch us more? No, they don't. No, they don't. In the fucking thing, it said, we love llamas, in the banner on the thing. A banner which, by the way, in the past, uh, has been used to say, breaking news, the Titanic sank 102 years ago today. A segment we also did not that long ago. This is what it's come to, man. I don't know why I'm bemoaning this. Well, I'm bemoaning this because it hurts the country. That's why I'm upset. Because the media is not doing their job. Their job is to hold people in power accountable, to get facts out there. They're not doing that. They're miserably failing at that. But, I mean, the bright side is shit like this is good for me. Shit like this is good for TYT. Shit like this is good for Vice. It's so funny to me that this is, like, in the same general time frame that Vice just had what may be the story of our lifetimes, which I'm going to get to in a second. They came out with this amazing story about this amazing medical breakthrough. The most amazing story I've ever heard. Ever. Amazing story. Amazing story. I won't spoil it right now, but... Uh, meanwhile, while they're doing that, what's CNN doing? Quiz shows and they have llamas on TV. The epic downfall of a giant that in the 1980s and early 90s could do no wrong. But now they're a laughing stock. CNN is a joke. They're, they're a giant joke. They haven't done serious reporting in such a long time, they wouldn't know it if, the, if it hit them over the head. So, go ahead, guys. Keep destroying your own uh, product. Keep destroying your industry. Unfortunately, take the country down with you. And uh, we'll be there to step in when you're totally done, and we'll do the right thing.